Come on, let's just go nail this prick. We got him cold here. Oh, yeah, we haven't. We're near enough. We'll just fudge the paperwork a bit. We're doing this one straight. By the book. Oh, yeah, the book. We always have to do things by the bloody book. Shame you never read it. Oh, yeah, I bet it's a real fucking page turner. Look, I've got two weeks left and I just want to keep my nose clean. After that, you can do whatever you want. So, why are you leaving? Is it the stress? Yeah, mate, it's the stress. Look at me. I'm a wreck. Yeah, well, I reckon you've gone soft, mate. Lost your nerve. What are you talking about? Well, I heard that you used to be hard. Now look at you. I'm tired, Ray. 20 years of my life I've given to this job. You're the fourth rookie I've been saddled with in the last two. You've all been the same. Young pups getting all worked up. You forget your training and you end up pissing all over the carpet. Meanwhile, I'll have to come in and clean up the mess. Yeah, well, we're losing the fight here, Jacko. The streets are infested with maggots like this one. And every now and then, we just might need to bend the rules a little if we're going to catch them. Look, well, I'll tell you this much. Me and Bronnie, we bought this lovely little B&B just outside Hobart. Three weeks' time, the only thing I'll be catching is a nice, big, fat trout for dinner. Ooh, tizzy trout. Quick, give me a cold spoon. You know what the problem with you trying to be a smart ass is, Ray? You've got the ass bit down pat. It's a smart part of the equation you'll always struggle with. What time's your watch, sir? 4.42. Well, that's funny. Because mine says it's time to punch in, old man. Just don't balls this up, pup. Fucking business. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I might want to drop the attitude, pal. I want to drop something in a second. Ray. Right. I've got this, mate. This is a one hour bay, and I've been here for 45 minutes. <laughs> this is bullshit, mate, and you know it. What my partner is trying to say, sir, is that your vehicle has remained stationary in this bay for exactly one hour and 13 minutes. We've given you 10 minutes, Grace, but now we have no choice but to issue an infringement. But, uh, you got bigger problems than just this ticket, haven't you, pal? What the fuck's that supposed to mean? It means that you've got form, asswipe. I've done fuck all. I think your, uh, rap sheet would, uh, suggest otherwise. Parking in a designated clearway. Parking in an allocated bus bay. Parking in a zone that is marked loading zone. And the one that really, really sticks in my craw. Parking in a mum's with pram zone. You sick, so there's something seriously wrong with you. So what are you gonna do about it? I'll tell you what we're gonna do. We're gonna issue you another infringement notice, huh? You'll have to catch me first. Jacko, you ready? Doing a runner, Jacko! I'm out! I'm out! I need a reload! There's no time! Take mine! Come on, Jacko! I'm in! No! Jesus Christ, I'm in! No, Jacko! Jacko, talk to me, Jacko! I'm all right, I'm okay. Okay. Ray, what are you doing? We've got him. He's in the system. It's not worth it. I may not have read your book, Jacko, but that prick just took out my partner. And in my book, that's not cool. Ray, for God's sake, don't throw away your career for me. Ray! 
Right! And at the depot. We have an inspector down. I repeat, an inspector down. The purpose executing a vehicular escape west along West Avenue in a black BMW. It has a distinctive white chalk mark on the front right tire. Commits in pursuit on foot. Ray, I've got no idea what you're talking about. Dot, this motherfucker's going down. behind a desk for a year, courtesy of a misconduct rap and a bung knee. Me and the missus moved to Tasmania. Bronnie had a baby. Unfortunately, I wasn't the father. You never know what life is going to throw up. There's one thing I know for sure. You do well to avoid the temptation to dance with the thin white line. Is this your car, scumbag? Because we're back on the beat, motherfucker. <laughs> 